Hi guys, I'm Caroline and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about my Rothy's flats. Before we get started though, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below. And let's get started. So Rothy's was founded in 2012, but I think that they really kind of took off um, last year in about October 2018 when Meghan Markle wore the flats on her trip I think it was to Australia with Harry and I mean people went crazy uh, they also bumped up their marketing campaign um, I think I saw this ad that said oh we're royally blushing or something like that to kind of echo the fact that the Duchess wore their shoes um, but I mean, even beyond the Meghan Markle hype, they are just really pretty shoes and they're completely sustainable. Um, the top is this knitted fabric that is knitted in a factory that Rothy's owns and operates in China. So they do have control over the conditions that their workers work in and it's knitted from recycled plastic water bottles which i just think is so amazing and so cool um it's really important for us to take care of our world our planet and our oceans are being choked by all the plastic that we use so this is one way that we can get rid of that and look super super cute they do make several different styles. I have the point here in the rosebud color. They make a rounded toe flat. They make loafers and they just recently released a boot option, an ankle boot option. I think that the boot looks a little too sporty um, for my taste, but if you're into a sporty boot that's super comfortable, I would definitely check it out. These flats in addition to being totally sustainable, are shipped in a sustainable way. So they come in this box, which looks a little bit worse for wear, I will admit, because I kind of ripped off everything on the front, but it comes straight in this box. And the shoes just come in here wrapped in paper with a little cardboard insole that is biodegradable. And what's nice about this is that you aren't getting double boxes. So this shoe box is sturdy enough for shipping, which means that there's less shipping waste. This box can be reused. If you can see here, there's another strip if you need it to return. I did do the returns process for Rothy's. I first ordered this shoe. I did get the point in the yellow. I want to say it was called Marigold. It was this mustard yellow, really gorgeous, and they didn't fit. Um, I would say if you're ordering in the pointed style to size way up. So I normally wear a five, five and a half, and this is a six size up at, like I would recommend a full size up and if you do order and it doesn't fit the returns process is so easy I returned mine and I was able to exchange it for this pair free shipping free returns I got this pair in a matter of days I want to say it was something like three days and I was so excited because I was planning on taking them on a trip with me and they arrived in time. So don't be afraid to try different sizes. If one doesn't fit, you can definitely easily return and get the size that does fit. Again, these shoes are super sustainable. They have to date recycled, I want to say about 35 million water bottles. If you check the site, it does say different numbers in different places. One place says 30 million, another place is 38 million, and inside of the box says 35 million. I want to say that's just an editing issue, um, but let's say anywhere from 30 to 38 plus a million water bottles have been saved. Another great thing about the shoe that makes it sustainable is that it is not cut out of a larger piece of fabric, which means that it's knitted 
to size. They don't cut this portion out, which means that they're saving a lot of fabric. And I think that's amazing because you, if you think about it, so many fabric scraps must go to the landfill, must need to be recycled. And if they're knitting them to size, you don't even need to go through the process of re-recycling this you know, inner portion here. That's amazing. In addition to it being totally sustainable, it's also so functional because you can throw it in the washing machine. You can wash these bad boys. So when I first wore these, I rolled over my toe with a wheelie suitcase. I got a big black mark on the side. It was devastating. I just went to the bathroom, grabbed like a wet paper towel. I was able to get it out in a matter of seconds. Let's say your stain is super stubborn. You can literally throw these in the washing machine on the cold setting. Obviously, I would put it on delicate. And if you have it, I would put it in a delicate laundry bag just to protect it. And they're completely washable. Another great thing is that the soles here are made from recyclable rubber. So truly from tip to toe, well I guess heel to toe. <laughs> Truly from heel to toe, these guys are sustainable and they're just so cute. Again, I would say size up and you'd be good to go. I do have to talk about one con and it's really only a con depending on how you plan to use them. So if you're planning on using them for travel and walking around you know, the streets of Italy, I do not recommend them. Um, if you can see here, the sole is very thin and there's not a lot of support. So this insole here that's removable does have a little bit of cushion, but it's not enough to support you if you're going to be walking long distances on cobblestones. <laughs> um, that said, I love these, love these for um, spare office shoes. I think that they're fantastic. So I'll go in the morning with a pair of heels on and instead of sitting at my desk in my heels, I'll switch to these. They legitimately feel like slippers, legitimately. So as uncomfortable as they are to walk long distances on concrete and cobblestones, they're super comfortable. Um, I don't want to say to wear as slippers, but they're comfortable office slippers. Or if you're going to lunch with someone and you don't want to wear heels because you guys are walking 15-20 minutes to you know that really great lunch place, you can switch to these, walk in these just fine. I would highly recommend them for that purpose. But again, if you are trying to walk really, really long distances, um, I mean, they're not going to hurt you in the sense that they're gonna pinch or anything like that. They just don't have the support that you would want if you're walking long distances like that. And I think that's true of a lot of flats, so I wouldn't put too much blame specifically on Rothy's. As you guys could probably guess, I highly recommend Rothy's and I plan on getting them in several more colors. It's really great when you can make a sustainable option that's really adorable and these shoes really do that and we're saving our oceans, you know? There's so much plastic out in the world and this is just one way that we can give back, reduce, reuse, and recycle. If you made it to the end of this video, please write the word Duchess in the comments down below. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I do really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, bye.